Miss Deborah, pleasure. This is gorgeous. This is a great idea. Look. Look at you turn can you turn around so they can see that it zips? Oh my gosh, this is so cute. I've never seen a sweater it's great shirt. For Los Angeles because it gets hot and cold and you can zip it and unzip it. So Oh my gosh, so pleasure to meet you. Pleasure to meet you. Of course I saw you on IMDB as yes. a cast member. Yes. Are you super excited about the show? I am super excited about this show. I have been a fan of Stacey K. Blacks for a long time. Uh, I had the privilege of being directed by her on an episode of Major Crimes, and she's a, a woman, she's a renaissance woman who can do so many things, and how she brought put this crew together, she wrote the script, she and Shay um, did a two-hander in directing it. It was, you know, a symphony of excellent production execution. They could teach a class in it, so I feel it was a great privilege to be a part of it. Oh, that's amazing, and I love how when you become family on a show, you keep working together and you just keep going and you yes. are on major crimes as well. Mm -hmm. I know I saw so many people that are coming also from that show. Yes. So can you tell us a little bit about your character? Oh, my character, she's a woman who has had a profound loss and is I think at a point in her life where she's suffered such profound grief that she's paralyzed. And I think it's an opportunity to look at, you know, with all that goes on in the world and the cover of Newsweek this week is, you know, looking at post-traumatic stress and big movements, like how we overcome the worst horror of our lives. And I think it's um, it's actually a real privilege for me to be able to go deep into somebody who's... And you said to overcome. So yeah. <clears throat> are there any major um, obstacles you've had to overcome in your life? I mean, I know as an actor, of course, or actress. <laughs> That's so a given. many that we can't even get into it right yes, here. Yes. yes. Well, as an actress, you know, um, what, what would be one of the major, you know, obstacles well, I think, you've had to overcome? I think we do it in any field. I'm also now um, working behind the camera a lot, okay. and I'm really comfortable behind the camera, but I have a lot of empathy for my subjects that are in front of the camera because I, when I acted more full-time, I, I suffered anxiety. I'd be, you know, stage fright, but you, you come up with tools to overcome that. Yes. But all of that experience I had with fear and self-doubt is only, as I've matured, has allowed me to understand my subjects or actors that I'm working with on a, a much different level. So, and that's so, so every hardship that you go through um, can teach you how to be have a, a broader experience with and, others. And even compassion for the next person. Absolutely. Absolutely. That's why we're here, right? Yes. yes. Well, it's a pleasure. You're lovely. Great. Thanks. And I love your eyes. I'm just into everyone's eyes. Like, beautiful, gorgeous Cause, eyes. Because you have You're beautiful. Eyes. <laughs> You're Thank beautiful. you so much for letting me interview you. I, I, I look forward you. to seeing the, the show. I'm just, I can't wait. Everybody is talking so <laughs> much about it. Everyone is excited. I'm so <laughs> you're, you're beautiful. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you, thank so, you much. so much. It's a pleasure to meet you. It's a pleasure to meet Have you. Have a great Thanks day. Thanks for being And I'll see you inside. See you inside. Awesome.